Good morning, children. How are you today? I hope everyone is doing great. Welcome back to Montessori Sessions with Miss Novi. Today, we are going to travel to some countries in Europe and learn about its traditional food. Are you ready, children? Let's go to the first country. Let's visit Germany. Wow, now we've landed in Germany. Children, what is the traditional food from Germany? Sour Britain. Sour Britain is a traditional German roast of heavily marinated meat. It is regarded as a national dish of Germany. It can be prepared from a variety of meats and most often from beef. Before cooking, the raw meat is marinated for 3 to 10 days in a mixture of vinegar or wine, water, herbs, spices, and seasonings. Now children, we are going to the second country. Let's go to... UK, United Kingdom. Are you ready? Get in your airplanes and off we go. Going to United Kingdom is the first you know. Now slow it down and land on the ground. And when you get out, you gotta jump all around. Welcome to United Kingdom. Children, what is the traditional food from United Kingdom? Roasted chicken. Roast chicken is chicken prepared as food by roasting, whether in a home kitchen or over a fire. Children, generally the chicken is roasted with its own fat and juices by circulating the meat during roasting and therefore are usually cooked exposed to fire or heat with some type of rotary grill. Alright children, now are you ready to go to the third countries in Europe? Yes, let's go to Poland. Alright, ready? Get in your airplanes and off we go. Going to Poland is the first you know. Now slow it down and land on the ground. And when you get out, you gotta jump all around. Welcome to Poland. Children, what is the traditional food from Poland? Pierogi. Pierogi are filled dumplings made by wrapping unleavened dough around a savory or sweet filling and cooking in boiling water. They are often pan fried before serving. Do you know children, the dough which is made by mixing flour and warm water, sometimes with an egg, is rolled flat and then cut into squares with a knife or circles using a cup or drinking glass. Pierogi may be stuffed with mashed potatoes, fried onions, meat, mushroom, cheese, or other ingredients. Dessert version of the dumpling can be stuffed with a fresh fruit filling such as cherry, strawberry, and blueberry. Now let's go to the fourth country in Europe. Let's visit Italy. Are you ready? Get in your airplanes and off we go. Going to Italy and 
the first you know now slow it down and land on the ground and when you get out you gotta jump all around welcome to italy children what is the traditional food from italy I'm sure you all know with this food. What is this? Yes, it's pizza. Pizza is food from Italy. Pizza is a dish of Italian origin consisting of a usually round, flat base of leavened wheat based dough topped with tomatoes, cheese, and often various other ingredients such as mushrooms, onions, olives, pineapple, and meat, and then baked at a high temperature. All right, children, now we've learned about the traditional food from some countries in Europe. Now it's time for you to do the activity, get your continent atlas, and your uh, activity, you can get it from your learning kit, glue and scissors. Let's start children! All right children, before we start, let us read together the countries in Europe, United Kingdom, Poland, Italy, and Germany. Later on, you have to paste the picture of traditional food of the countries. What is that? That is pizza. Pierogi, sour Britain, and roasted chicken. Now let's us cut the lines.
Okay children, now it's time for you to paste the picture of traditional food of each country. Like Italy. What is the traditional food of Italy? It's pizza. Children, you can continue to paste all the picture in your continent atlas. Well done children! We have traveled to some countries in Europe. We went to Germany, Poland, United Kingdom, and Italy. And we have learned about their traditional food. Don't forget to click your photo and take your video and then you upload it in season. Alright? Thank you so much children. Happy learning. Goodbye.